Hello and welcome to the last day of Vlogmas. Ah, I know I'm so sad it's over. Honestly, this has been a super fun experience. I will definitely be doing this again next year, but I will be planning it out more because this was kind of rushed for me. Still, I really hope you guys enjoy these videos, but without further ado, let's get into my Christmas haul. So you might notice the lack of like my squishmallows that are like in every one of my videos of me on my bed. They're not behind me because I have all my, some of my littler gifts and my stocking stuffers on my bed. So it's easy for me to grab them and show you guys. Okay, so I went to three Christmases today. I went to my boyfriend's dad and his stepmoms in the morning, and then I went to my mom and my mom's parents. So my mom's, my grandparents on my mom's side after that. And then I came back home for my grandparents that I live with, my dad's parents, and then we did our little Christmas here. So I'm gonna be separating this into like different segments of different things. So first is gonna be hygiene. I have a huge pile of hygiene stuff here. If you don't know me very well, I love hygiene products. So I have these two body washes. This is the Soft Soap uh, Lavender and Honey Cream. I believe this is from my boyfriend's stepmom. It smells delectable. I love it so much. And then I have Cake. I love the brand uh, Cake. I don't know if they're just a Canadian brand, but they have like, um, well, like cake scented body products. And this is Deserted Island and it's like Coco Supreme. Um, it's a body mousse. I love this brand so much. Highly recommend. Then I have a bunch of razors, which I have been in dire need of. I have been using like three blade razors that aren't the best. If you watch my hygiene video, I'm not using the best razor. Razor, so these are definitely needed. Then I got this uh, bath crumble. It's a foamy bath crumble, so kind of like a bath bomb. And Blue Lagoon, I have not smelt it yet, um, but I think it's like blue raspberry-ish, which is awesome, and it matches my hair. And then toothbrush and toothpaste. I don't think I've ever bought my own toothbrush or toothpaste. I just always wait for Christmas to come around and then I'm like, oh, new one. I still have like a stockpile. There's certain things for Christmas. Like I just don't buy my own like deodorant. I bought my own deodorant once. I just wait till Christmas. Like I got two, two deodorants. Like this will probably last me till next Christmas, cause I have one going right now. So I'll run through these by next Christmas. Then I got this Bath & Body Works Eucalyptus Mint hand soap. I'm just gonna give it a sniff. I have not given it a sniff yet. Oh God, no, this is gonna explode in my room. So I'm not gonna give it a sniff, but I'm assuming it smells awesome because Bath & Body Works always smells good. And then I got a bunch of face masks. I love face masks. Funny enough, I actually just, I had the same one and I just used it the other night. And I was like, oh man, like I wish I had more of these. So thank you for this. Um, then I got, I love these uh, Life Brand face masks so much. I got oil removing one, detoxifying, another detoxifying and then illuminating. These are all those ones. And then I also got a hydrating uh, sleep face mask. And there's like multiple in there. This looks cool. This looks like a little kid or something. And then I got these little eyebrow razors, which I can't believe I haven't purchased before. Like they're so perfect for doing my eyebrows. Um, those are from my boyfriend's stepmom. These are awesome. And I'm super excited to start using these to shave my eyebrows. And then I got this EOS shaving cream, a little travel tube of it. But if you remember, literally in my last video, I I used that shaving cream. I love that stuff. So I am thankful to have this little travel tube. So now I have a little re-up of that shaving cream. And then from my dad, he got me some uh, dry skin repair Vaseline hand cream. I absolutely love Vaseline products. I just use straight up Vaseline for lip chaps sometimes. Super moisturizing, especially in the winter because I've been washing my hands a lot. I am not about to get the Omicron, so this is super helpful because 
my dry hands. I wash them too much. I also have from my dad, I got some all-in-one cleansing wipes. Uh, these, I actually didn't have any. These are great for when I mess up my makeup inevitably, because inevitably, because I always do. Just a quick fix, you know, swiping off some eyeliner, or for when I'm out, or for lazy nights when I really just want to take off my makeup and just go to bed. So I have these from my grandparents on my mom's side. I have these from the meadow, uh, pumpkin sugar scrub, uh, as well as a vanilla bean body butter. I smelt these earlier. Oh my God, I'm gonna use these right after this video and I'm gonna have the best shower ever in love with these scents. And then I also got from them, it's from the meadow vanilla lip balm. I tried this, I love it so much because you know how some lip balms are kind of like hard to put on? This one glides across your lips so smoothly. I don't know why I love it so much when lip balms do that, but like I'm obsessed. And then I also got this Burt's Bees Coconut and Pear. That is from my dad. Love Burt's Bees. I'm a huge fan and the scent is really nice. I love this flavor. Is it a flavor or is it a scent? Regardless, I love this one. And then I got a little soy wax candle. I actually have not smelled this one. It's called Tree Farm. Oh my God. It smells just like a fresh Christmas tree. Never had a real tree personally, but my grandparents have, and this is what it smells like. Oh my God, I'm obsessed. And then I got some wax melts. I got this little one called Frosty Witch. Oh my God, this one is so hard to open. Open up. Come on, okay. Frosty Witch. It smells exactly how the name sounds, like a frosty witch. <laughs> and then I got this one called Midnight Summer. Smells delectable. Smell like <laughs> there's such strange names because it's like a feeling. Like it's not like a scent of like a strawberry, but like it smells like a midnight summer. <laughs> and Seaside Escape which smells like a beach, like a seaside escape. And then rainy day. Let me guess, this is gonna smell like a rainy day. No, I've already smelt it. I love it so much. Oh my gosh, it smells so fresh and clean, like a, like a rainy day. Then I got some little thin black hair elastics, which are actually a lifesaver because I have been running out. I run through these things uh, just for doing my hair. I often style my hair with these, so these are super helpful. And then these boot gear socks for when I wanna play out in the snow, if it actually snows this year, but I love warm socks in the winter. Usually I hate them. I hate wearing socks in warm seasons, but like recently I've been wearing, I've been using all, all of my fluffy socks wearing them at night because my house gets really cold. <laughs> Next from my mom, I got a bunch of septum jewelry. So I got this titanium silver set. It has the horseshoe uh, hoop one with the, like the same one I have, just an extra one, which is always good to have. Um, and then it has one the same way, but it has little gems on the balls, super cute. And then just a full hoop. Um, and it's always great to have titanium jewelry, jewelry because that is the highest quality metal you can get uh, for piercings. And then I have this cute little cross. It's adorable. Um, I didn't realize how tiny septum jewelry was until I'm looking at it outside of my nose. So cute. And then I have this adorable little spider. I am so excited to try these all on. I'm gonna wait a little longer to try them on uh, cause I don't wanna risk it. I'm pretty sure my nose is healed by now, but I really do not wanna risk it. I don't typically get a lot of clothes for Christmas because people don't really know how to buy clothes for me, which is fine, but I did get a lot of good clothes. So I got these super cute sweatpants. They are so soft. I am in need of more sweatpants. I keep like accidentally ripping. I always sit crisscross applesauce. It's like a bad habit. And I always accidentally rip the crotches of like all of my pants. So I needed more sweatpants. These are cute. They're gray and then they're super soft. And then I got this Grinch. So they're Grinch sweatpants and then a Grinch hoodie. Okay, okay, hold up. I'm gonna have to stand on my bed <laughs> to show you. Oh, I'm cutting my face out. Okay, can you see me? Okay, these cute Grinch, like, sweatsuit. I don't care if it's Christmas themed, I'm wearing this year round. This is super cute. 
I'm in love and so comfy too. And then I got these yoga pants. Okay, I have uh, another one of the exact same pair of these yoga pants. But the thing is, I literally wear them so often that I'll wear them for five days straight without washing them, which is totally disgusting. So my grandma's like, nah, I'm getting you another pair. You're nasty, which thank you so much, grandma, for that one. So if you've met me at all, you know I'm absolutely obsessed with Squishmallows. Even if you haven't met me, if you watch my videos, you've seen them in the back here. Obviously they are gone right now. Uh, they're all on the floor because I have to have all my gifts on my bed and there's no room. I can't even sit on my bed. <laughs> I have to put them on the floor because I have way too many. Uh, my boyfriend's stepmom got me this Squishmallow. His name is Horace. He's a cute yeti. He's got a fluffy tummy. He is so cute. I absolutely love him. And then, okay. Funny story about this. So I was in Walmart in like July with my grandma. We were grocery shopping. We went down like the home aisle and I saw this blanket and I have this comforter I have on my bed. It's black, but it's reversible and this color matches perfectly. So I was like, oh my God, you want a Christmas gift idea for me? Give me this blanket. Like I would love that. It's super fluffy and soft. And she, uh, I didn't, I completely forgot about it until I opened this today. And I'm like, oh my God, you actually got it. And I was like, when did you get it? She's like, oh, I picked it up like a week after. <laughs> I thought that was super cute and funny. I have not taken it out of the package yet. I feel like I should to embrace its full beauty. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, oh it has this cardboard thing in it. That hurt me. Ah, oh shit. I can't see. Oh no. Ah, get out of here, go away. I am so cozy. I am never leaving my bed, <laughs> ever. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. So, okay, <laughs> I'm just gonna change into it. No context, just gonna change into it. My dad got me an Udi. <laughs> I can fit my entire body inside of it. I'm like freaking out. Like, like I said before, I am never leaving my bed. I am so comfy. I don't even have to have arms anymore. Goodbye. I'm just a blob now. <laughs> I love it. And it matches my hair. And where are you? Oh, it matches my Yeti. I am so happy right now. It is light blue, obviously. And it has these cute little koalas on there. I'm so happy. I'm so happy about it. It's just like a massive blanket i love it so much oh my gosh so as you can see i already put my squish models back on my bed i can't believe i almost forgot one of my favorite gifts this year from my boyfriend i got the first three five nights at freddy's novels into the oh <laughs> into the pit uh fetch and 1 35 a.m um I was beyond excited to be able to receive these. So excited to read them. And then I have the first graphic novel, which is The Silver Eyes. Ah! Oh my God. Kieran, which is my boyfriend's name. Kieran, if you're watching this, I love you so much. You're the best. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this Christmas haul and I really hope you have enjoyed my vlogmas. I will be sure to do it again next year. So make sure to subscribe if you wanna keep up with my channel, if you wanna see more content. I upload weekly on Fridays. And subscribe so you can see next year's vlogmas, which will be a full 12 days, I promise. But I will see you next week for another video. Love you, bye.